Hi guys doing and welcome to another Arc Garage video. If you want to see more Alfa Romeo related content, make sure to hit like, share and subscribe. In today's video I'm going to be doing a DIY honeycomb uh, grill on my Alfa Romeo 147. Also if you want to check out how to remove the grill, I'll put the link to that in the description below. The first thing that I'm going to address are these bumper crossbars which are painted red as the rest of the car. If I put the grill mesh over them, uh, it's not going to look good. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to protect the bumper and I'm going to plastic dip uh, these parts in the matte black. Now I'm going to take the original grill, I'm going to outline the shape in the honeycomb mesh, uh, I'm also going to cut it out and I'm going to paint it with uh, plastic dip. Besides that, I'm going to take uh, these uh, chrome parts from the bumper vents and I'm going to plastic dip them in matte black as well. Uh, it does make a lot of sense to keep them in chrome since everything else is going to be in black. To remove them, all you got to do is unclip these three uh, plastic clips, push on these uh, little plastic parts and push the uh, chrome clips out. Just like that. Alright, uh, I'm close to getting done, I've secured the uh, bumper vents to the bumper, now I gotta secure this uh, grill mesh uh, to keep it nice and uh, sleek, uh, I've decided to uh, use the automotive silicone to glue the bottom part, now when it comes to the uh, upper uh, side I'm gonna use something else, but uh, before you continue make sure that you mount the hood latch. Uh, that's very important because if you uh, secure the uh, grill mesh you won't be able to do that afterwards. Uh, now to secure the top part I'm gonna use these uh, plastic rivets. Uh, there are already holes from the previous uh, Scudetto which allow me to secure the new grill mesh in place. There they are right there. Uh, you actually got the other options uh, you can use as well there uh, is one uh, pre-drilled hole right here in the middle and if you want to decide to keep the grill uh, flat uh, you can use it to secure it as well uh, here it is secured with the plastic rivets as you can see the grill mesh is curved and it actually follows the curvature of the bumper Finally, let's check out the end result. Uh, the new grill uh, looks nice and sleek. Uh, I gotta admit, a bit more modern. Uh, now, the best uh, part about this uh, transformation was that it was very simple and uh, you can easily revert it back to the original if you get uh, tired of it. Another uh, thing I gotta mention is the cost. You can get this uh, honeycomb grill mesh in different sizes and uh, depending on how much you need you can get it for uh, 15 20 euros also the uh, plastic dip uh, you can get that for uh, some 10 euros that would be all for this video if you liked it uh, hit the like button and support our channel by subscribing and by sharing our content with the rest of our festival.